All right, we're out here with the master from Big Goat, and uh, we're gonna do do a small trail run against the S22 Pro and the master, and see how the Pro uh, compares to the master. All right, let's go. We'll start with this downhill run. It's like a little track around here, and I'll see see how it compares. Let's go. Master first. Now, my favorite part about the Master is the high pedals, but the high pedal, when you hit a hard dip, can throw you off just a little bit compared if your pedals were a little bit lower, like the S22. But besides that, the Master does rock. The nice part, if you get the Master today, you get the metal case battery box, which is a nice upgrade because uh, before you just had the plastic and then you had to buy a fairing and all this protection. But uh, I'm glad that they did that. So it kind of compares a little better now to the S22 because the S22 build quality was better than the Master for sure. But the Master just always had the performance. Do a run back and then get the right, here's our last run on the master before we get the S22. Alright, it's a little breezy out. Pro. Uh, first thing I notice when you get on this one compared to Master is how low the pedals are compared to the Master. But uh, let's go do a quick run and see how they compare. Now I'll say the S22 Pro is still lacking good braking power compared to the Master, but besides that, it competes with the Master, it's just that braking. I don't know why it, that wheel just does not want to stop that fast. In the master, uh, the biggest difference is just that pedal height, and uh, you know just how it feels between the legs. But uh, let's go back and uh, see how it how it feels. But the suspension, uh -huh. it dampens out just the same, I would say, almost on this type of trail. Let's go. On a trail like this, my honest opinion, I can't tell the difference between the two suspensions. They both felt pretty much the same. I mean, on the on the rocky trail, I like the S22 better, but on something like this, I can't tell the difference. So if you're doing a lot of street riding or whatnot, I would probably go with the Master. But if you're gonna do more trails and drop your wheel more often, maybe go with the S22. But my honest opinion, it's uh, we, whichever one you could probably get a better deal on with a better warranty. Uh, but right now you can get the Masters for pretty cheap, so it'd be a hard decision. Now you got the new Extreme uh, Bigode coming out. I would probably go for that wheel over both of these with the specs so far. 
but uh you know hit that like button and if you guys want some more content like this let me know on that master coming up here and you can torque it real easy so let's see all right i torqued it I mean, it's, a, it, it's about the same, I would say now, for sure. But yeah, they definitely stepped up the game with this new motor. All right, well, uh, when we get out to the bigger trails, I'll do another video, and I'll even get the T4 out, see what you guys think. All right, later.